Welcome back, folks. It's Saturday on Farm Sim 2222. And here we go, folks. Let's kick a tire, get started. So, in between last episode and this one is the stream here. We did some marshmallow farming, as you can see. Um, we did cut down our grass and we did roller. Uh, we did mulch this field up, so we are pretty good to go on that front. And we did chop down this little section right here. So we're sitting pretty good on that front. But we have, watch out, car, geez, right away to pedestrians. Uh, we're going to go ahead and we are going to start this canola harvest. And I'm real interested to see um what we get from the canola also this while i really like this harvester um and it is pretty good oh oh before we start too before we start um let's look at our scores down here <gasps> an environmental score literally jumped to 84 just running it in there we're gonna find out even more that's insane so we'll see how this goes um but the one thing i will say is that the harvester could use a little bit more power i mean it's fine for now but uh when we go to start up you can see it really when you turn on the header and go ahead and run um it does struggle a bit so wow this is gonna be a big field here guys um we are gonna do a montage here but holy cow is this gonna be a big one all right let's get started folks As you can see, we have this uh, 
canola field done and we did in fact get quite a bit of canola if we look here we ended up with 55,000 so this is definitely our biggest field because uh, canola produces less than wheat if we had had wheat over here this probably would have been over a hundred thousand which is absolutely a hundred percent fine what I think is gonna happen is we're going to sit down and figure out which what we're going to start putting in these fields but we're not going to do that in this episode um, a few other things here quick let's take a look at our scores it did go down a little bit but i think that's a mulching uh, that brought it down a little bit it's interesting that this jumped up instantly the second i harvest started harvesting um, I kind of want to see how this one plays out as well. So what is the big difference? It's a top bar on them? Oh, okay. Huh. Must be uh, yield amount or something. Anyway, we have uh, some other news. Where are you? Um, we've had to bring the Kramer over. Our forklift... Our, good old green forklift it just disappeared out of nowhere so you can see we don't have it anymore i don't know what happened to it i didn't uninstall it or anything like that sadly there's nothing in the thing that i think is going to help us while another truck would be kind of handy we don't need it um and we're going to be trying to make save some money for our next little deal which is going to be a chicken coop um, we, we desperately need to get into chickens. Uh, we have that wheat now, so we are definitely good to go on that front. So let's go ahead. I have one in mind already. I like the size of it. I like a lot of stuff about it. And if we could get this. So we have to remember where, all right, where is all the stuff on this, right? So uh, it looks like. Huh. So it looks like we need the ends open. So let's do... Alright, that would leave both ends open, right? I don't see any other little hoobly-dooblies that could mess us up. Overlaps with another... Don't you say that. We want that type of negativity around here. I think this is probably good here. Can we go one more over? Nope. So it's overlapping with that building. All right. So, bam. Um. Oh, and that was forty grand or eighty grand. That was quite a bit. Um, let's take a look at what we're gonna need here. Oh. Okay, so open the gate. All pallets are going to be on this side. Oh, fancy. All right, let's buy some chickens. I think it holds like 400. Open animal log. We'll do five roosters. And I know that this thing will fill up fast. Trust me. I am super well aware of that, but I think we are going to put a lot in here uh, because they are so cheap and I do want it to just start producing. So let's buy 60 by, oh, let's buy 60. Can you actually sell from this menu too? Yeah. Okay. That's right. Well, I was just making sure because we have that animal dealer. Um, Hmm. How many how many do we want to go with? I'm thinking for now we'll go with halfway full is what I'm thinking. So 750 is what we're gonna do. And yeah, because that way if we ever want to sell them. We could, 
uh, to get more going in there. But I think this will be enough to really get us going just because they're so cheap. I am not actually sure how much this is going to require. So we're going to go over here and we're going to do a couple things here. We're going to try to fill it up. Uh, we spent all our money on this bad boy, so we're hoping it's going to work. Let's go ahead and get it. Oh, we're going we're gonna to get it backed in there real nice, don't we? All right. Let's try to get it close. Obviously, that was real perfect. I was actually paying attention to where I thought the thing was, not my trailer. Uh, oh, is that going to take all of it? Oh, it's a good thing we planted a bunch of wheat then, ain't it? Uh, let's go ahead. It's going to try to save here. But this is going to give us another huge income, which is going to be really nice. Um, we need to make sure we're having a lot of incomes because now we can't rely just on the sawmill factory um, to do everything. And we need, we're going to run out of that metal ore here real soon too because we got to invest in, we got a lot of purchases we need to do. And um, one of them is going to be the payloader so that we can keep loading iron ore. Otherwise our iron ore process goes down. Oh, we need a whole nother load yet. Um, one thing too is I moved our fuel um, over, well, let's fill this back up here out of our deal, man. So I actually think we're going to do another, we're obviously going to need a big wheat field because these are going to burn through the wheat probably pretty quick. And then also, let's see here. Yeah, there we go. I topped off our fuel, and then we're going to bring it over. I don't know if I have enough money to fix, uh, actually go ahead and fix the gravel over here. We'll see. Um, and we do need to make a little bit of a walkway. Oh, okay, okay. So you're going to be dumb. And we're going to do the backup thing again. Oh, shoot, that's right. It's a double axle. which really aren't that hard to do if you're paying attention. It's a lot worse, though, if you um, if you aren't, though, because it will mess your day up. Jeepers, where is that unload deal there? I don't know if this is going to fill it or not. Oh, it should. I'm hoping it does. And I'm really curious, and actually, I think we're going to advance just to see how much they in fact actually do use up here so before we advance a month though and see what they go through actually we could hmm now nah, we'll just put this back in there well, that way it'll give us a good clearing to see but let's go ahead before we do that i know we got no money left <laughs> but let's go ahead and try painting well, let's try to get this. All right, we need a little roadway there. Just like that. And let's see if we can get this road back. Oh, what is going to use up all our money, ain't it? All right, actually, I mean, it did use up our money, but not actually the end of the world I don't believe no all right so I think what we're gonna do now is let me advance a day we have 53 dollars guys <laughs> that's so crazy <laughs> oh man we're running out of money folks so we did advance into here into September and you can see they already produced three egg pellets. That's not bad at all. Um, a few other things. Maple syrup went on sale. And when I mean it went on sale, 
It, it's even higher right now than it is in its peak in February. So I do believe we are going to go ahead and sell our maple syrup real quick. Um, and let's go ahead and check at that pen. It did go through a little bit, so I will top it off. But the fact that it's going, you know, it's produ it's it's producing. So I'm I'm super happy with that. Um, hmm. It does, I like how they have straw animation, but it doesn't require straw. I find that very interesting. All right, so let me get the trailer loaded up, and then we will go sell uh, some maple syrup. I'm going to refill that thing to the uh, chicken barn. Wow, didn't realize we had that many pallets in there. Hopefully this makes us a pretty penny, though. If you look, we have baby sheep as well. Let's see how much money we get here for... Uh, our deals. So I'm glad we got the baby sheep. We got some more sheep going. In fact, one more thing here as we get closer uh, to the end. Oh, we're getting not so bad. This is kind of a good little deal here. I'll take 13 grand. That's not so bad. So uh, one thing here, we're going to leave the semi. Let's go run over here. Um, we need a 3,600 fabric to go ahead and sell our, uh, our to go ahead and finish our boat. And we do not have that right now. Um, I think that we just have that 1,000. I'm going to go check over here. We have some couple pallets. I'll go bring them over so they get product produced. And I was hoping to get a... Um, Hoping to get our boat done for the next episode. I don't look like that's going to be a possibility, though. Anyway, we got baby sheep, and we got chickens, and we're off to a, a really good winner here. So I will see you in the next episode, folks.